Chrome Remote Desktop is Google's own remote desktop app that allows you to control your PC from another device and remotely access files on a PC. In today's short tutorial, I am going to show you how you can control your PC in real time from your Android device using Chrome Remote Desktop. Start by opening the Google Chrome browser on your PC. Then open the Chrome Remote Desktop website. Click on Access My Computer to go to the Remote Access Interface. You will be required to authorize the site with Gmail ID. From here, you can install the Remote Desktop app, which will create an app shortcut on your desktop for quick access. It's also required to add the Chrome Remote Desktop extension to your browser. Download the remote access host file. Run the host file. It will enable your PC to connect to the remote desktop app. Then set a pin. You will need this pin to connect to this computer from your Android device. Having set up Chrome Remote Desktop on your PC, now it's time to download the app on your phone from Google Play Store. On the Android app, you have to sign in to the same Google account you used in your computer. After you signed into the same Google account, you should see the computer name here. Tap the computer and input the pin you have set on the computer. You can now access your PC remotely on your Android device. From the top bar, you can enable the touch or mouse functionality. And also, you have an on-screen keyboard for all your tasks. Chrome Remote Desktop allows you to open a program, open files, copy and move files and do other tasks on your PC. However, it doesn't have any functionality to transfer files from your PC to your Android device. So if you wanted to access a file remotely, you have to use a trick. You can simply open the browser and email the file to yourself so that you can download it on your Android device. One more thing, you can also sign out or shut down your computer remotely by sending the Ctrl plus Alt plus Tel command. And if you want to close the remote connection, simply click on disconnect. That's it guys, you can now access your PC remotely from anywhere you are. This is a good solution for remote desktop control while on the go and best part is it's completely free to use.